uh, talk né, uh, for us, a new rumors, new rumors in New York. Man, I am from Brazil, man. I saw in Twitter, né, uh, and so many platforms. But uh, do you know about new rumor uh, about the Knicks? Do you can talk uh, for us in Brazil? Oh, do I know of any new rumors? <laughs> Not really. I mean, <laughs> I guess the most interesting question right now, and the Mark Stein of the of he has a Substack uh, newsletter that's very good, had something about this today that like how motivated if the Knicks get Donovan Mitchell, how motivated will they be to try to move on from Julius Randle? Um, that has been my number one question of the entire offseason, putting everything else aside. It, my number one question of the offseason from day one has been, does this organization feel comfortable bringing Julius Randle back? Or is it a priority for them to try to move on from him, you know, in the right circumstance? And obviously there's different things that will go into what that circumstance is. It'll, it has to do with, you know, what are, are they getting something for him? Um, you know, we'll, I don't know. It, does it have to do with, are they going to get another ball dominant guy? Because that's, that's the other thing about the Donovan Mitchell stuff is like, no one thinks that this team makes sense with Mitchell, Brunson, RJ and Randall. Um, mm -hmm. So, you know, uh, that's probably the one thing that I would have my eye on uh, moving forward. I saw today uh, Westbrook. I, I yeah, saw, but, uh, but that's not. But that would Mark Mark clarified that as that's not that Westbrook would be coming here to play. In all likelihood, he would be coming here and be bought out. And the purpose of bringing him here would be as an expiring contract, and um, you know, with an attempt to for the Knicks to get some cap space uh, <laughs> yes. next summer. Albeit next summer is not looking to be a great free agent class. I, I mean, I know like technically right now, I think LeBron and like Harden and Kyrie and, and Chris Middleton are all scheduled at eh, none of those guys are coming to the Knicks. Um, Andrew Wiggins is an interesting name. I know he's not. See, yes. He's not, yes. he's not the sexiest name, but that dude's, that dude's a good player. Um, so anyway, we'll see what happens. We'll see what they do. <laughs> E aí, pessoal, este foi mais um vídeo aqui no canal Nick Fans Brasil. Espero que vocês tenham gostado, né? E como é de praxe, pessoal, você, você mesmo que está assistindo pela primeira vez o canal Nick Fans Brasil, não se esqueça de se inscrever, se inscreva aqui no canal Nick Fans Brasil. Não esqueça, né, você que já é inscrito, de ativar o sininho para notificação de novos vídeos. E também sempre deixar o seu like, um comentário, compartilhar com os amigos, por que não? Para ajudar com que o canal Nick Fans Brasil chegue cada vez em mais e mais pessoas, pessoal. Beleza? Conto com a ajuda de vocês, Nick Fans. Um abraço! Are you down with the orange and the blue?